Hey everyone, it's me Howard and welcome back to the HR Show Experience. I am so happy to come here today because we're going to talk about the halftime show for Super Bowl 50. And we're going to talk about Gaga. But before we get into all that, please hit my subscribe button so you don't miss out on all of my new videos. Thumbs up this video if you liked it. And please leave a comment letting me know what you think about my video you're watching right now. After it's all over, okay? Because I want to know what you think about my video as well as the halftime show. Did you watch? But getting right on into it, okay? Did you watch the Super Bowl? What did you think of the game? What did you think of all the ins and outs of that, okay? Maybe you're new to me because I have gotten quite a few new subscribers. And hello and thank you and welcome. But I'm not the biggest sports guy, okay? Listen, I don't even know who was playing. I know that Lady Gaga sang the national anthem. And first things first, like I was hearing a whole bunch of different things, but I thought she did a good job. I felt as though she really was trying to go in there and knock it out of the park. Um, she was giving me Lady Gaga, you know, in her entire outfit and whatnot. Um, the only thing I wish she had done was just stand still. Because she was moving around a lot. Okay, like she was kind of doing too much for me. I just said, girl, just stand there and sing that song. Everything will be okay. And I did feel that she was trying to give me a bit of Whitney. But truth on truth, there was, that was no Whitney. Okay, that didn't even come close to me. But Gaga did do a great job. And I'm very happy that she did it. Like, I think that's an amazing thing for Gaga. And I'm so happy for her. Y'all know that I am Whitney's number one. Okay, she is the end all be all for me so her version is just it but jumping on to the halftime show i love the halftime show i thought it was pretty good um coldplay and just uh, pausing for a second did y'all see that tweet from taraji p henson and she's gonna say oh my gosh maroon 5 is giving me life i was done i was too finished i could not even breathe but either way coldplay was giving me life because i was like oh yes i know this first song then they kind of lost me for a second because I was like, oh, wait a minute now. I don't know this. But then Bruno Mars came right back on in there with some Uptown Funk You Up and some more. I was loving it. But truth all the way, I was waiting for Beyonce. It was the reason for the season, okay? Because Beyonce dropped that good, good song, okay, the day before the Super Bowl. And I loved it, okay? The song is everything to me. And I loved the performance. The performance was exactly what I wanted. I was so caught up in Beyonce, like, looking amazing and doing all the things that I love. I didn't even get the whole Black Lives Matter thing until seconds ago. But bless the whole thing because Beyonce saved that show, okay? And did you see her almost fall, trip and stumble? Lord have mercy, Jesus. But she caught it though. She didn't even have to put her hand down. She caught that thing real good. I was like, uh-oh, Beyonce, I see you, girl. But overall, I would give this uh, whole halftime show a good B+. Plus. Okay, almost the A. Because Beyonce really came through. And then when they all came together and started singing with the with the Uptown and some more, it was real, real good to me. I loved it. I thought the whole thing was super duper gay. I didn't quite get that. I was like, why does this whole thing seem so gay to me? All the colors and stuff. You know, I don't have a problem with it. Okay, yay, yay, yay. Gay for the gay. But I was like, why is it so gay right now? Like, I didn't get that. But uh, tell me what you think <laughs> in the comment section, okay? And don't forget to thumbs up this video if you liked it and hit my subscribe button. Please hit my subscribe button because I'm happy to have you and I don't want you to miss out on all of my new videos. I am so back here, okay? Here I am on the YouTube. Okay, I don't know if you're new. <laughs> well, you should. You're watching. Anyway, don't forget to check out my online store so you can get all of the coolest t-shirts ever and there's going to be some new ones coming out really, really soon. So make sure you check back. It's shop.spreadshirt.com forward slash Howard Reese and there's a link in the description. Oh yeah, and there's links in the descriptions for my social media, uh, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, everything, it, Vine, okay, it's all in the description, okay, so you can click it take you right there okay and if you have any trouble just message me search for me howard reese it's not that difficult love and don't be scared to say hello okay don't be scared because i'm super friendly but thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye I need